I'm live. It says I am live. Well, I feel alive. How are y'all doing today? I hope I got the camera set up correctly and that we have enough speed, download or upload speed to do a live stream without a lot of interruption. So I'm trying to get this right. Anyway, what else? Cheers, pro, pro school, all that stuff. Well, Jennifer, <laughs> bless your heart. <laughs> Looks and sounds good. Thank you, Jennifer. Bless your ears to you, girl. Skull. Mm. Muy bueno. Beautiful day here in Alamogordo, New Mexico, for sure. There's Mary Cooper and Glenn. And hi, everybody. How are you Rangers showing up today? I was close to not being on time because, as usual, right before the video starts, there were some people that called and text and stuff. And then uh, I got some emails about the RV and stuff. And, and yeah, it was, uh, it got real busy, right? Just about 10 minutes ago, but I, I just went right on through it. And here we are guys. Friday night live, Mary Cooper. Hey, Glenn, Mary, hi, Mary. Y'all talk to each other. Enjoy yourself. And I'll enjoy my Friday night beer 30 with you guys. And uh, on and on we go. Explorer says, hi, Rusty. Tom, living the life. Boy, ain't I really. I mean, I'm living the life. <laughs> it's, I'm having fun, I'll say that. Yeah, it, I stay busy. Uh, it costs me a lot of money, but I stay busy. Uh, that was Tom Carey. Uh, time for dirt. Hey, hey. Hi, all. Happy Bear 30. Thank you, San Barnes. Hello, everybody or everyone. My old lady's cooking show. Hi, Rusty. That's a catchy name. Uber girl, Barbara. Hi, Uber girl. And uh, Jason says, hey, Rusty, happy G TGIF, happy beer 30. Bottoms up. Bottoms up. Here's to you. Here's to me. Hmm. I got to tell you, that car I bought, that Toyota Corolla uh, uh, SE Hybrid, is an amazing vehicle. I'm averaging 67 or 68 miles of the gallon. I mean, that's crazy, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, but, you know, I didn't, anyway, enough said. Rita says, beer 30 sounds great. Well, that's good. I'm glad we got a good connection and it's all working out. I looked into the possibility of getting another internet provider, but there's they're pretty limited here. Uh, Justin says, cheers, Rusty. Happy Friday. Happy Friday to you and all you Rangers. Good to have you with us. Uh, Dolores and Bruce, happy Friday, everyone. Uh, Nor something. Did you bring your trike to your new digs? No, I left them. I left it there. Uh, no way. Uh, because the people that are going to bring my stuff out here, I don't want to abuse the privilege. Tom says hybrid better. Hybrid better NS full E cars. Oh, I, yeah, well, uh, it's, it's all it is is an EV with a motor to charge it instead of charging it at home. Diana says, whatever, hi, made in the shade, happy beer 30 from Rome, Georgia, Rome, Georgia, Georgia on my mind. Explorer says, I just purchased a Toyota RAV4 and love it. Well, you know, the Toyota, you know, and it's no, it's just a fact, they make a very good automobile, okay? And uh, I just happened to have gotten one. I, I had two two or three Priuses, and I liked all of those. Tom says, does your home sound like an auction selling your RV? No, it's not that. I mean, you, we get a lot of inquiries, but it's uh, I, I'm not. there's no auction to it. I, I'm, I'm stuck on 75000 and that's it. There's no, no dealing. Now, if you want to offer more, I'll take it. Uh, Mina or Mina says, hi, Rusty. This is Monica from El Paso. Just letting you know I'm enjoying the Chevy Belt. You know, that's good to know. I mean, I, I, I was wondering how everything worked out. And I'm very happy that, that it worked out well. Tim G, if you sell the RV, are you going to keep the Starlink? Actually, I had a guy contact me about the Starlink, and I told him I'd sell it to him for 300 bucks. But I don't know how he's going to get it and how you turn it, transfer it, and all that stuff. But if he figures all that out, he can have it for $300. Why? Because I have no plans for using it. Eileen, let's see what your new home is looking like since you're settled in. Yeah, you'll see that in a day or two. I mean, I've got a video of the inside of the car, you know, showing the white instead of the black. And then I did a, a video of the inside of my uh, tiny home here. Now that I have redecorated, you're going to be very impressed. <clears throat> Coming up in a couple of days, 
Tom Carey. I, I just stuck that Class B video in there today because I, I want to get it sold. And right now is a good time, you know, spring, summer coming on. So I wanted to get, get the thing out there. Uh, Tom says, Rome, Georgia, home of a branch of USMC and Coors. Well, yeah, well, drink that Coors and wave at the Marines. Alvin Masso, congrats on your new car. Thank you, Alvin. Alvin, remember there was a song about that. Hmm. Uh, let this, I'll let this comment move up and then I'll read it because <clears throat> it's got that heart right in the middle of it. So anyway, guys, it is Friday. Chill out, relax. You know, the whole thing is to kind of enjoy, you know, regain your sanity such as it is and uh, enjoy your life. Now, here we go. Miami says, hi, Rusty. I struggle with regret. What advice would you give? I value your experience and your take on life. Thanks. Don't have any regrets. If it's if it, you already done it, don't worry about it. Shit. You can't change it. Go forward. Jeez. You know, I mean, I mean I've got regrets, but I forgot them. You know, uh, Norris says my 2006 Corolla I bought new now has 286,000 miles on it. I, I, I believe that poodle professor says, yeah, that heart is in the, in the way. Yeah, it's right there. You know, Alice says, where's the beer 30 light? It's a, it may be in transit. I'm not sure they're, they're coming here in May. They may bring it. The realtors coming up here. Uh, on a vacation and we're just friends. So she's going to bring it with her or uh, some stuff. Uh, Sheridan says, hi, I just caught your live at 5 PM central daylight in Texas. Yeah, it is 5 PM in Texas right now. As a matter of fact, <clears throat> uh, Rich says, hi, Rusty. Did you consider a Prius prime? I, yeah, I, I consider the Prius is for sure. The downside of it is the new Prius, They've made it so aerodynamic that the front windshield slopes so much that there's no headroom in the vehicle. Okay. Uh, I've got about two and a half inches above my head in the Corolla and in the Prius, none. So Justin says, uh, have you found any good pizza places by your new house? Well, not right next to it, but there's a Lowe's grocery store that has uh, what do they call it? Brick fired pizza or whatever it is. And then there's another place down the street that say, they say is even better. So we're good on that. Pete in Pennsylvania, what is the heart for? I, I don't know. It's just on the screen. You know, YouTube puts it up there uh, for some reason. Uh, Scotty says, do you drink pop resting? No. I, well, I drink a Diet Dr. Pepper occasionally, not often. And I get the, you know, I just go to a gas station and get whatever they got a diet drink. Alice says, another episode as Rusty's head's head turns. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. Well, Alice's restaurant. Andrew says, hello, Rangers. Well, hello, Andrew. Pete in Pennsylvania says, I miss the old Prius better. Yeah, the old, I had two Priuses. You know, I went camping in one for years. Or actually, both of them. And, uh, you know, it, it was a, it was an experience. I don't think I, I'm up to it now. You know, it's just like my Class B out here. It's a camping machine. You know, it's perfect you know, for one person, but I, I'm not a camping machine anymore. I found that out, you know, I've, I've just, we'll, we'll let that go. I, I, I got, you know, of all times to call, swipe up to answer, swipe down to decline. I'm just slide down. Yeah. Anyway, <clears throat> I'll call them back. But anyway, see what I mean? It just, everything happens at the same time here. Uh, Sheridan says, is your Corolla hybrid? Yes. I think it means a gas electric car combined. Is this correct? Yeah, it is. Sort of. Yeah, it's, a, it's got a, well, never mind. It's got a built-in charger, so to speak. Diana says, sorry, I was driving. New home. Howdy. Cheers. Cold drink. Hot pizza. Hi, Rusty. Jennifer. Hello, Diana. Belinda says, hi, Rusty and Rangers from a windy Val Verde County. Yeah, well, I, I see where y'all are getting some wind down there. Republic, what happens to video about neighbor's house oh well the the lady has never called me back to do their the video there's like three homes for sale here uh one of them has the exact same layout as, as mine and the other two don't but uh the the other two people haven't contacted me and i'm not gonna bother them anymore i mean it's it's a free ride for them anyway uh scotty says do you watch golf on tv rusty uh, occasionally i, I watch it uh, reruns on youtube 
Miami says, what's for dinner tonight? Well, I'm going to make me uh, two uh, bean and cheese tostadas with lettuce and tomato. Uh, and and uh, yeah, and have a little glass of wine. That, that's it. Yeah. And then I had a, a, a stuffed bell pepper for lunch, uh, which was good. You know, and uh, yeah, bell pepper supposedly got some good stuff, probably a lot of vitamin C. But anyway, guys, here's to you. Here's to me. And here's to Romeo and Matilda and all that gang behind me there. Here's to all of them. Mm -hmm. So anyway, I have had some inquiries on the class B, but, uh, you know, until the money's in the bank, you haven't done anything. I, I've learned that over the time. Scotty says, I like Mexican food too, Rusty. Yeah, I like, I like Tex-Mex, I guess you'd call it. I don't like some of the real exotic Mexican food. You know, they have it highbrow, you know, restaurants, you know, green enchiladas and all that crap. No, just give me the, give me the old, give me the old, uh, Cheese enchiladas or whatever, you know. Phyllis says, hi, Rusty. Love watching you. Keep on keeping on. Well, I try, you know, I mean, it's, you know, but things happen, you know. Uh, poodle professor, if, if I didn't have the poodles, I'd take the class B in a second. No, I understand that. It wouldn't work out for you. Your dog's too big, you know, for that thing. Uh, Bucky says, wahoo, made it. Well, Bucky, we're all happy for you. I'm, I'm especially happy for you because I was wondering where you were. You know, Diana says, hi, Glenn. Okay, hi, Glenn. Gabriel says, good afternoon, all. Patrick here, haven't been here for a while, but here now with my Beer 30 game. Yeah, you got, you got your game on, huh? Bucky says, right here, buddy. Buddy, buddy, bo, buddy. Yeah. No, we're good, man. We, we got a good group of guys, and, and you know, we weed the garden, or I, you know, I, I keep the negative neds and negative nancy's out i don't want to hear a bunch of crying about well i just didn't earn your surgery i don't care about that man you know get keep your health you don't have to worry about it uh peer p daly says cheers to us i hear you cheers to us is correct cheers to all of us we're all good folks we got a good group man over the 12 years or whatever it is i've been doing youtube videos and you know kicking people off the channel i think i'm up to nine over nine thousand now that i've kicked off of this channel for being rude and obnoxious you know we don't need that crap you know, you know uh, but anyway, be that as it may, it is Friday night. You're here to regain your sanity and enjoy your life. You know, chat among yourselves if you choose to. I don't care. You know, the main thing is just to relax and enjoy your life for what it is. Here's to you. Here's to me. Scotty says, I like to watch the news. Rusty, you do you, Scotty, and you do it damn good. WP Wood, you will love the mini split this summer. Yeah, I got I think so. Uh, you know, they, I keep hearing that the utility bills in these little tiny homes rarely runs over 50 or $60, even in the summer and winter. So we'll see. Uh, Explorer says, I will miss your camping videos, Rusty. I've enjoyed your camping over the years. Looks like you have a nice tiny home. Yeah, I like my tiny home. I really do. And, and the whole area is fine. You know, it, it's just like a little neighborhood. You know, you got some dogs that bark, you know, maybe some people that don't do the right thing at the right time. And and that's the way life is. You're never going to find the perfect spot. You know, Joe says, could we pause for a moment? The wine bottles in the kitchen. <laughs> Aaron says, hi, Rusty. Relatively new sub here and enjoy learning from you about easing into retirement without getting bored and keeping it simple. That, that's the whole key, man. Norris, Norris says, well, with all your wheeling and dealing, don't forget the mind changer. Oh, don't worry. The mind changer's here, but Bev, Cheers to you. Cheers to you. Scotty says, do you watch the news? No, I don't. I don't ever watch the news, Scotty. Gabriel says, hello, poodle professor. What? You don't want to, you don't know. She doesn't want to buy it because it won't work for her. That's all. Um, uh, Mary says, Rusty, do you have a porch in back of your home? No, I got a front porch here. It's about 10 by, I don't know, 15, I guess, or whatever it is, 10 by 12. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, I got a great view of the uh, Sacramento mountains when I'm sitting out there in the evening. No, it's great. Uh, Paul says, Rusty, have you got any bites on the class B? Actually, several. Uh, but, you know, you know, if you get 10 people saying they're going to buy it, you, you'll be lucky if you get one all the way through. That, that's, that's just the way it is. Lisa, Lisa says, hello, Rusty and Rangers from California. Well, hello, Lisa in California. We're glad you're here with us. Thank you. Justin says, do you think you will do some cabin camping? It's possible. I, I'm still looking into that. I've got some other options also. Uh, yeah, Poodle says she would if she didn't have the dogs. Uh, welcome, Aaron. Hello, Scotty says, 
did you play many sports, Rusty? No, I didn't, Scott. I, I wasn't I wasn't a natural athlete. I played tennis, and I was good at that. Golf, I was pretty good at in high school. But as far as football, basketball, and other stuff that the girls loved, I didn't do any of that. I, I racquetball. I won some tournaments there too. Mike says, uh, "Cheers, Rusty. I love all the bits of Rusty wisdom over the years. Keep on keeping on." Yeah, well, I'm trying to, babe. I mean, believe me, I'm well aware. I <laughs> mean, uh, Lean says, "Could you drop?" the right side of your gang down a little on the right one quarter to one, one eighth to one quarter inch. No, I ain't going to bother with it. If that bothers you, uh, turn your head a little bit. He lean, it'll work. Uh, Gabriel says, hello, Lisa, Lisa, Northern California here, just North of San Francisco. All right. Tracy says, hi, Rusty. Hi, Tracy. And, uh, yeah. Uh, Jason says, uh, would you be able to pull a small teardrop camper with the Corolla? If so, what would you want? Well, I, yeah, it's hard to say, you know, it'll, it'll tow 1500 pounds. So that would mean I need to get a trailer that, that, that about 800 pounds. And then you put about two or 300 pounds of stuff in it. I, it's not designed to tow. So probably not. Uh, Gabriel says, Rusty, real, real wisdom to life. Well, I, 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 it's just old. That's all rich. Rusty, on your tiny home, do you own the land? Yeah, I pay a, no. I pay a monthly uh, lease of three hundred eighty dollars a month. That includes water, sewer, trash, and all outside maintenance. Lisa, hello, Patrick. Okay, a Ange Angela says, "Hey, Rusty from Tennessee. I love watching your videos. Have a great win weekend. Yeah, all you guys have a great week. You know, it's easy to say have a great weekend or have a good day, but the fun, the whole thing boils down to you." working on that and making it happen. You know, what is a good weekend or a good day or a good moment for you? And if you haven't thought about it, then you'll never have any. I mean, or you won't know you did, you know? Angela says, hey, Rusty from Tennessee, I love watching your videos. Have a great weekend. We're working. I think I read that. Paul says, uh, Corollas are rock solid. Great choice. Well, that, that's one of the reasons I got it. I mean, you know, I, I, th I don't think my oldest son is excited about it, you know, but I do me, you know what I mean? I have to make my own choices. I'm all grown up. And uh, yeah, Scotty says, you in New Mexico now, Rusty? Yeah, I really am, Scotty. He says, LOL. Alice says, got a tent that I won last year. You want it? Uh, no, if I decide to get a tent, it'll have to be something I choose myself because it, it'll be, it would be an extraordinary tent. Follow Jesus. Hey, hi, Rusty. I'm enjoying your changes. They're great. Keep making it happen, my friend, Angela, North Carolina. Thank you. P. Daly, what are you doing for the solar eclipse? Probably taking a nap. <clears throat> Doesn't excite me a hell of a lot. You know, yeah, you can you can damage your eyes, you know what I mean? And, and all it is, is it, it, never mind. It's, it, it, it doesn't happen that often, and I guess it's a big deal for some people. But, no, I think I'll be inside reading a book. Uh, Gary says, great weather in the Gulf Coast of Texas. That's wonderful. Bev says, uh, is your family in New Mexico too? No, my, my family is all in Texas. All my exes live in Texas. Alice says, price is right, free. No, I got you, uh, Alice, but I, I don't think I'll take it. I, I don't want you to clean out your storeroom using me, okay? Here's to you, here's to me. Yeah, free is a good price. Gabriel says, I'll be inside reading a book for the solar eclipse as well, Rusty. Uh, Jennifer, Poodle Professor, check her channel out on YouTube for sure. Seen one eclipse, you've seen them all. Yeah, it's just a strange thing. It, it, it was a big scam back when the Aztecs and the Incas used to tell their people that uh, because they, they had studied the stars for a thousand years and they knew when these things were going to occur. So when they were just fixing to start, they tell the people, look, if you don't start doing better, your taxes or whatever, or do these sacrifices and crap, you know, the sun's going to be eaten up by the evil spirits. Well, and sure enough, it would start happening. And then they would have to get their act together. They sacrifice everybody that was a threat to the then leadership. And, uh, and on and on they went, you know, fortunately, we, we've, we're a little bit better than that. We have elections that are rigged because we don't have any choice in who's going to run, but we do go vote. Uh, Deborah says, Deborah in East Oregon from Deborah in East Oregon from Tennessee. Okay. Made in the shade. It's supposed to be a comet that's visible once the eclipse which it reaches totality. 
Well, again, I don't, I don't know about that. You know, there is Halley's comment that comes around every 140 years or whatever it is. Doug says, sure love all your driving videos, Rusty. Very relaxing to watch. Yeah, well, you know, they're easy to do, and, and it's easy for me because I'm just talking to myself. You know, I'm just kind of getting my thoughts together, and, and, and you just have to be listening. That's all. It's very easy to do those. Gary says, we will be in central Texas for the eclipse. That's a good place to be. That's right where that's the, the, the highway it's going across right there. And, uh, yeah, but, but the media has got this thing so hyped up, you know, they're already selling, uh, e eclipse, uh, glasses. You know what I mean? Bev says, did your neighbor put her tiny home up for sale yet? Actually there's three for sale and one for rent here, Mary. Follow Jesus waiting on you. Give us a tour. It's it's coming. Uh, here's to you. Here's to me. The car is sweet. Thank you. No, it's coming. I, I I had to move them a little bit today, but yeah, in the next two or three days you'll see the interior of the home the way I decorated it. You're gonna be very impressed. I'll tell you that. Yeah, the, every, all that overstuffed crap is gone. Anyway, not that it was bad. It was great furniture for somebody else, but not me. Uh, Mary says, have you found a driving road? Uh, well, you know, I guess you could say yes. I mean, I mean, I, there are several places I can go where it's not that busy. Follow Jesus waiting on you to give us a, oh, I read that. Yeah, I think I probably read some duplications there. Wayne says, evening Rangers. Well, evening Wayne. Uh, Rich says, hi, Rusty. What is the name of your tiny home community? It's called uh, Centennial Tiny Home Community. It's on... Uh, Florida Avenue in uh, Alamogordo, New Mexico. Follow Jesus. I know it. I know it. Be cool. I'll, I always enjoy home. You do it. You do the homes. Yeah. Well, whatever. You're gonna see it soon. Scotty says, "Nice shirt." Oh yeah. This is uh, the cat in the hat. You know, calculate us, eliminate us. If you want to find out where something is, first you got to find out where it ain't. Well, by God, I have found out where it ain't. I mean, to tell you that. Aaron says, I am glad I won't be in the Austin area for the eclipse. Lived there and ACL and SXSW made it unbearable. Well, it's just it's just a crowded city. It's just a big city. You know, uh, Aaron, I read that. WP Wood, Corolla, battery, 100,000 mile warranty. Is it 100 or 150,000? I think it's 150 now on the 2024. Sure, it doesn't matter. I won't keep it that long anyway. And Sheridan says in Northeast Texas, outside of Dallas, all government build, buildings, post office, bank, city halls are shutting down during the eclipse. They are treating this situation like a hurricane. Well, do what they want to do. You know, go hide in the closet, cover yourself with a bed sheet. Uh, Jennifer, poodle professor, check her channel out. You're right about the hype. Some schools are closed. Kind of sad because it's a great teaching moment for kids, especially those who might not get a chance to see it without proper or with proper eye protection. No, that's true. You know, it'd be great to have some science teachers, you know, buy a hundred of those cheap glasses or let the school buy them and, uh, you know, do it that way. Dave says, hi, Rusty, getting here late. I'm having a little incinerator. Happy days. Whatever an incinerator is, I hope it works. Uh, Justin says, do you think you will ever go to Texas? Oh, yeah, hell yeah, I'll, I'll go back there a lot. That's my home, babe. No, I, I, as far as being a Texican or a New Mexican or a, a wherever, Oklahoman or whatever, I'm just me, man. And and, I, and that's all I do. You know, I don't worry about labels stuck on my back. Wayne says, won't be long. I'll find out where it ain't. But yeah, that's true. You, you finding out where it ain't. Yeah, I got it. WP Wood. Yeah, it says 150,000 miles. You're right. Yeah. And, and you know, that for me, 10,000, that's 15 years. You know, I'd be... 93 or four, whatever that happens to be. Uh, I, I'm not worried about that right now. I'm worried about right now and this beer and you guys. Okay. Here's to y'all. Here's to me and all that stuff. Tracy says schools are closed here and several businesses also in the Fort Smith, Arkansas area. Well, you know, that that's the way it is. You know, I don't have any response to that. I, I don't know, man. I, I just, Remember many years ago when we had eclipses when I was 10, 12, 15 years old, nothing happened. You know, you got a Coke bottle or something or 
a particularly a seven up bottle because they were dark green and that was your glass, you know, uh, and nobody told you about going blind. If you did, you just did. Dave says cinnamon snaps, snops is like fireball liquor. Well, hang on to that boy. Your liver, your liver is going to love you. Gabriel says, I think they might be closed because it's good Friday, three days before Easter, whatever, you know, uh, Diana Haas says, wow, 30 minutes goes by so fast, maybe an hour. No, we're, we're going to stick to 30 minutes. Why? Well, if for some reason, this, this it, it tires me out. I mean, it doesn't make me tired, tired, but I'm aware that I've done something, okay? Neon says, hello, Rusty. Lisa, Lisa, do you think you will st still camp or stay in cabins? I'm not sure. I'm working on a plan right now, and uh, it's coming together slowly. Uh and I'm in no hurry. You know, I've got my, I've got a home and this is a very neat little house for me. All right. Uh, Bev says, are you enjoying the larger TV on the wall? Actually I do, but I don't put any sound on. I just put on one of those, uh, like flying over the USA continuous kind of movie things or whatever they call them videos. And yeah. And, and just leave it on. You know, I walk around and see the, uh, Grand Canyon. You know what I mean? Dave, Dave Lee says, uh, LOL. Tracy says, I don't have a response either, but nothing I can do about it. So no worries on my part. No, I got you, babe. Eileen says, are you going to visit Levi soon? No, I, I don't think so. Uh, Eileen, I'll, I'll just keep doing me. And, you know, I, if I happen to be in that area, sure, I'll run by his place. Uh, Gabriel says, Rusty, I, I did want to say, like the new home and even the new car. Well, thank you, Gabriel. I appreciate that. That makes me feel uh, better about my choices. Diana says, I understand. Thanks for being here, Rusty. Well, thank you. Th you thank you guys for being here because it wasn't for you. I wouldn't be uh, riding around in a class B and have this tiny home. Well, I might. I might. I might. Anyway, uh, Scotty's giving us another bowling report. Uh, he did. A, he, uh, he bowled 204, 208, and then a 161. Yeah, that, that's excellent, Scotty. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad to hear that and hope you and your dad conti continue to enjoy it. Lisa, Lisa, I love the new house and car. Congrats. Yeah. Well, you know, if you're going to change, change it all. You know what I mean? <laughs> Just change everything. You know what I mean? You know, I even bought some new underwear. Well, I bought one pair. Anyway, uh, Misty says, happy Easter. Uh, when is Easter this year? May? Uh, Alice says, not this weekend, but next weekend, vintage car show in Artesia, in case you want a driving video. No, I, I, I thank you, but uh, I probably, I, I'm not big on that, you know? And, uh, but thank you. Gabriel says, good job, Scotty. Very good. Scotty says, bye-bye, something, T-T-Y-L, whatever that means. Good night. Good night. Uh, Terry says, good changes too, Rusty. Uh, Diana says, T-M-I-L-O-L, whatever that means. T-M-I, Texas Military Institute, maybe. Uh, Poodle Professor, Easter is this Sunday. Well, I wonder when it was. Justin said Sunday. Yeah, okay. Well, that's good to know. But be that as it may, guys, we've got about two minutes left, so y'all suck down your beer or whatever you're into, and let's enjoy the evening and the weekend coming up. Mm. Nor says something. Is that a full glass? Is that a full glass front door behind you? Yes, it almost is, yeah. And it's got some blinds in it, mini blinds that you can move this thing up and down, and they open and close. No, it's great. It's double pane. Great. Uh, Jesus says, uh, oh, my, now you got to include the underwear in the new home video. Ha, ha, joking, my friend. Yeah, I hear you. No, I got me a thong, too. Uh, Republic says, Scotty, have you ever rolled a 300 game? I, I, nobody, unless you're a pro. Diana says, too much info on the underwear. What, what, what the hell is that? You know, everybody, most people wear underwear. Some people don't, I guess. Alice, time to go buy my Easter ham. Mike. Looks like Romeo is sniffing the goods on Matilda, whatever. Wayne says, bye, bye, Rangers. Y'all enjoy it. Buck Elkins, uh, thank you, kind sir. Neon Rusty, is your car a plug-in? No, it's not. Lisa, Lisa, bye. Y'all have a great Easter. You too. Glenn McNeely, good evening, all. Tom says, wishing you a blessed good Friday. Yeah, all you guys have a great weekend. We're about, I'm going to finish it up here. Thumbs up, guys. Carpe diem. Adios. Bye-bye. You know, use the Amazon link in one of my other videos if you want to buy something from Amazon. It helps out a little bit. But anyway, guys, we've been at it. Uh, we're fixing to hit 30 minutes here, and that's the time we end. 
Uh, Margaret says, Rusty, you look great. Have a, well, I feel good. You know, I mean, I feel good. Poodle Professor, check her channel out and enjoy your life, guys, one day or one moment at a time. Carry on. Adios. Bye bye. We are done. We're out of here, babe. We are out of here. Got it. Bye.